Hey, it's Holly Brink with eXp Realty. Welcome to part one of my video series, The Home Selling Process. Today we're gonna to talk about interviewing agents. So the first step in the process is to ask friends and family, neighbors, um, do some research and try to find some top agents in your area. It's not always necessarily the person with the most signs. Sometimes that's an optical illusion because they might have a lot of signs but not a lot of closings. Uh, you definitely want an experienced agent who's experienced in selling because representing a buyer and representing a seller require different skills. Many of us can do both, but there are some that specialize in one or the other. I recommend interviewing at least three agents. Don't let your relationship, uh, whether they're family or friends, affect your decision. This is a big decision. The agent you hire to represent you, you have to have faith and trust that they're gonna do a good job and you're gonna trust the advice that they give you. So what we like to say is, are you doing your friend a favor or are you trying to sell a house? So keep that in mind. And unless of course you wanna use me, then you don't need to interview any other agents. But for the rest of you, make sure you interview at least three agents before you make a decision on who you wanna to hire to represent you. So stay tuned for part two in the home selling process video series. We're gonna talk about selecting the agent and what you're gonna do from that point forward. If you have any questions at all, please reach out to me at thinkhousesthinkholly.com.